What's up, people? This is your boy Mellow Man Ace at Padrino, coming from Southgate, California, and you are now watching Chicago Street TV. Peace. How did you get the name Mellow Man Ace? Yeah, uh, the name Mellow Man Ace. Do you wanna? Do you know the story of how that happened and why he he wasn't with them? I guess towards the start of the blowing up of the NWA career. You know what? I a lot of credible sites were stating that Big Pun was the first ever. Yeah. And so when that happened, I don't know what year Big Pun got it, but when he got it, at that time, did he mention that he was the first? You know what, at that time, here's what happens in hip hop. What what, what were your thoughts of Fidel Castro? Or what are they? Um, you know, how did you get your music on the radio? How did I get my music on the radio? Um, How did the group form of Cypress Hill? The group Cypress Hill formed. Do you believe Cypress Hill were the first rappers to rap about weed or have an album pretty much dedicated to all weed? Uh, I remember when we had spoken on the phone, you had told me that you wrote for the Cypress Hill Spanish album. Los Grandes Éxitos en Español. Which tracks did you write? Yeah, I wrote, for that particular record, I wrote. How often do you um, stay in touch with your brother, Sandal, and Be Real? Um, to be honest with you. How did you meet Kid Frost? Or do you remember when you first met Kid Frost? Man, it was so long ago. Um, the first time I met Kid Frost, like a shot at Easy, yeah. Easy E. Yeah, um, yeah. Um, I was just out of curiosity, what what that shot was for. What was your experience working with Jerry Heller? Because I know a lot of artists all have different types of experiences with them. Yeah, well, Jerry. What are your thoughts on the Illuminati? <laughs> oh wow. <clears throat> my my thoughts about the Illuminati what? I'll, I'm gonna tell you straight up right here. I'm the first Latino to go gold and platinum in the USA and in Mexico, and I still have the gold records to prove it. Said, um, do you have any upcoming projects or any works coming? Well, first of all, I just want to say thank you. Yeah, 30 years since Escape of Havana. It just Escape from Havana is just crazy that time would go by that fast. And, Cuando yo 